What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today, uh, the 2.0 update dropped for Destiny 2. With it, many, many changes came, which I've covered in numerous videos today, which you can find via clicking on my name or icon. Uh, today, I can reveal how you get Forsaken gear, which can be weapons or armors. Absolutely amazing people. Also, exotics with random rolls have also been confirmed to be dropping. But before we do that, guys, I am giving away an exclusive Gambit emblem to win it simply like the video and leave a comment down below also guys stay tuned until the end of the video to find out about my monthly controller giveaway and as usual guys if you do enjoy the video leaving a thumbs up really helps me out okay so this week's flashpoint is on mars so go to mars now you can either do this via doing public events or do as i did and just run in and out of a lost sector killing the boss opening the chest real easy and real fast because the flashpoint on mars people gives you this new forsaken armor and weapons epic now upon doing the last sector about eight times i then went to anna bray and to my surprise she gave me a new forsaken helmet called the scatterhorn mask and it looks badass check out its perks bow targeting improved target acquisition accuracy and aim down sight speed for bows remote connection gain bonus super energy and sniper rifle kills rocket launcher reserves increase the amount of rocket launcher ammo you can carry and special ammo finder increases the drop chance of special ammo now it isn't limited to just armors like i said people i have seen people posting they've received weapons too for doing this flashpoint some seen on screen now now it also seems that the only way you can actually equip said armor pieces and weapon pieces if you ain't over a 400 power level because if you are over a 400 power level mark the armor and weapons require you to be a level 32 to 35 to wear them i'm so glad now i didn't go for them raid four or five weapons now I'm guessing if you lower your power level it could help but I am pretty sure the game now has a feature in place which counts all your gear whether it's stored or not towards the gear and the power level they drop at. Well if you guys figure it out and figure out how you can do this let me know down below in the comments section. So get and do the flash points people and let me know what you get from them. Okay, so Exotics dropping post 2.0 for a second. It seems to be having random rolls on them. Now, I've been sent about eight pieces of information stating this is factual. A couple demonstrate on screen now. We can see the Peacekeepers right here for the Titan and also see the Hunter's Aphidia Spaith chess piece. Both seem to have random rolls on them. Now, it seems it's Exotics that drop from public events which seem to have these random rolls. Now, I ain't saying Exotics from other places don't offer the same. I just can't confirm they do at the moment, but can confirm they do from public events. But to be honest, I don't see why other Exotics dropping in the game wouldn't offer the same. So yeah, guys, plenty to do and chase. Now we know exotics are dropping with these random rolls. Absolutely awesome. Now I have to switch characters and do them flashpoints again and try and land myself a Forsaken weapon. But on that note, guys, I am at just a quick video on how you can get this new Forsaken gear. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, it really helps me out. Also, guys, remember every month I give away a fully customizable controller. To be in with a chance of winning, simply drop a like on the video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, and follow the Gleam link at the top of the video description. But guys, on that note, I am out. Thanks as always for stopping by, and hopefully I will see you on that next one.